Hey peeps, this is Andercon again, and today we're going to build something epic. Alright, I'm going to show what else this thing can do. I think I'll uh, give stairs a shot, see what it does. Huh, I wonder which direction... Oh, looks like it's going to make stairs uh, going that way. Uh, so I'll let this thing do its uh, thing for a bit, and I'm going to keep building on this. Well, I need a buttload more sandstone for that. Good thing I've got shit tons. Goddamn. It wouldn't be a bad idea if I uh, made an automatic uh, crafting table for this. Hmm. I have to look up how to do that. Let's see how that works. Uh, maybe another time. Get a little bit more. Good enough for the moment. Now, so far this thing's looking pretty bland, actually. But I got a plan for it. I'm gonna spice it up like a bitch. Should be at least 20% cooler. Maybe more. If uh, this house over here is uh, a model, pretty much everything I build is going to be quite a bit different than normal. I don't usually build anything normal. Now, with my, that uh, automatic uh, building castle uh, video I got up, um, there's a lot of stuff in that map, and I made that map available as well. Uh, I even got a replica of a house in Oblivion. Rosenthorn Hall, I think it is? A Rose Hall? Something like that. Uh, it turned out really good. Um, of course, as good as it can get with a Minecraft replica. And, uh... Really, just the inside looks good. The outside front looks more or less accurate, but uh, not not the um, not the rest of it. Let me actually go uh, go show that real quick. Let's see, I got that world sitting right up in here somewhere. Uh, it must be down here. This one. And snipe. And this is it. I got all sorts of crazy stuff in this. This is a uh, world I started building on just for fun and just to practice, make a whole bunch of neat stuff. I was thinking about making a some sort of map, adventure map or something, but it never, never happened. It still may not ever happen. So, um... This is pretty well accurate, as best as I could make it uh, in Minecraft. It's Minecraft's rather limited, but uh, I did what I could. And here's the bedroom. It looks pretty good. This little table, chandelier. While I'm at it, I could probably show off some of the other stuff I got over here. Um, somewhere I got a bed, so I can actually make this day. And you can see what things are doing, what everything is. God damn it. Screw you. I'm freaking naked here. I mean, do I look like I got weapons? Punch you right in the boner. Die! Screw this. I'm just showing shit off. You don't need to be here. Maybe later when I uh, do a run through of um, a dungeon I built, or mostly built, I'll uh, I'll turn on the difficulty, run through it. Of course, it's sort of empty. It's mostly just the structure, but you know, it's got a lot of neat stuff in it. I got most of the traps and stuff in it that said over there. 
there's a giant skeleton. I'm actually going to make another one of these, probably in the world I'm in. Over here is a whole crap load of uh, redstone, well, a whole bunch of piston doors. Uh, I first made this map when I first, uh, when piston doors, or pistons first came out, and this is where I played around. So, here's a 3x3 three three I was experimenting with. It turned out fairly decent. Uh, there's better ones out there. But I like that one. Um, over here is just a 2x2, two two, completely hiding. It's pretty neat. And here's something I actually seen in some other video and I thought I'd replicate it. I don't know why I don't have uh, bookcases right there. So wait a moment and it'll close itself. See, up here was a lava trap. Well, something experimental. Um, give it a minute. It's got to warm itself up. So the idea behind this was to jump across a whole bunch of these and they would uh, retract, but I probably messed with it or things have changed since. Uh, I might have uh, made it so it doesn't work anymore. I think the original ideas were they were going to uh, um, retract after a little bit and then come back up and they were going to alternate but I think I decided just to make it wait a long time so you'd sit there flick the switch and go wait what the fuck nothing's going on it didn't do anything and then you know eventually you'd come back and you would have uh, pads to jump on these are just empty boxes I was gonna put dungeons in them Let's see over here I've got um, See, this is an Aztec temple, basically. And it's got a little maze inside. So, let's go ahead and run through that. Uh, hold on. Well, I don't have any any tools or weapons. I was going to go ahead and put on the stuff. I could go ahead and do that for the fun of it. Let's see if I've got any anything in here. I don't know if I have any tools. I don't see any wood. Oh, I know. I'll just bring that. There's a whole bunch of wood right here. Bunching trees gives me wood. Yeah, yeah. Let's see. Not that. I want stone sword. And uh, I wonder if it was dark in there. I can't remember. I might have lit it up. I don't really have much anything but a little redstone light. <laughs> Better than nothing. The other things I got in here, which I'll show in a minute, that's a neat uh, fountain. I've got a piston maze right over there. Over there is my um, self-building and repairing castle. So, here's the maze. Yeah, it looks like I went ahead and lit it up for now. Oh, I was going to turn on the difficulty. And I built this quite a while ago, and I don't really remember the layout. It's not really big, but uh, it's something. Somewhere. Yeah, I probably was too close for anything to spawn. But, uh, oh well. I got more than one maze in here. Um, uh, shit. Is this it? No, this is the entrance. Crap. I'm lost in my own maze. God damn. Uh, actually, I think it's right on the other side of that wall. 
if I remember. Let's see, you gotta go this way. There it is. And I was gonna have your prize here. And you could leave. So I'm gonna go over here and uh we can check out this little uh, fountain and then I'll hit up the piston maze and then for the grand finale I'll turn on that uh, the piston um, piston build uh, self-building castle now the thing with that is after you've turned the thing on uh, I'd have to go into uh, MC edit and delete all the blocks if I wanted to do it again Alright, this was just a neat little idea for you hit a button and it'll uh, fill up this whole fountain with water. It takes a little while. There it goes. And uh, it'd go through the pillar and it would go out the next pillar and then out the bottom. So one source block runs the whole thing. And it's just really neat looking too. I did a great job on designing that, if I say so myself. Yeah, uh, inside I've just got a little bit of redstone. Let's see, uh, I don't quite remember the name of the uh, circuit I used. Let's see, what was that called? T flip flop? I think that's it. I just got a T flip flop on the inside. Buried in the back, surrounded by creepers, apparently. Don't blow up. Come on. Come on. Oh shit. Oh shit. Please don't blow up. This is my baby. I don't wanna... Ah, there's way too much shit in here. Anyway, it's just this little bit of redstone back in there. Screw going than that. Push! Push! Nope. Yeah, taking a swim. Screw you. That's my pole. Pole's closed, bitch. Let's see. I wonder if I got a ladder on this. Yep. So I got redstone in the center of this. Uh, I don't have anything to bust this open with. And it transmits to four pistons at the top. Hey, sheep. And uh, they're underneath, I think, uh, this block here. And here. And there. So slow going up this waterfall. I um, wonder if uh, it actually raise the same speed underwater if you're reading. Huh. Interesting. Slightly. Barely. Now here you can see everything. Yeah, I went and cut out this whole giant area with MC Edit. It's just a bunch of pieces. Some houses I was going to use in the little town. Uh, all these pieces over here are actually bits and pieces of that maze. I'll go check that out later. It's It deserves its own video, I think. Um, oh. Yeah, this works. Oh. Barely. Hey, squid. Next up, we got uh, Piston Maze. This actually took a long time to build right. Uh, of course, you have to design a maze itself and then play around with the pistons and make everything work. So, it doesn't look like much of a maze. And then it lags like a bitch, and a, a giant maze just pours in and it closes you into it. Um. Um. I it's been a couple months since I built this. I don't remember my way through it. Uh, I I think it's this way. Maybe. Now the good thing about this maze is it's well lit, so 
I don't have to worry about creepers blowing up on the inside, I hope. Oh, I hope. Oh, shit. I, I'm gonna get lost in here. I'm gonna be, once again, lost in my own maze. Uh, is this it? Maybe? I think this is the way? Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Now you it. And of course, if you're a little claustrophobic, this is just going to screw with your brain. Um, um, this it? Actually, I think I had an idea. If I didn't think of it before, I just thought of it now. To have like a maze like this, and then the entrance or the exit was, you know, hidden until you found a button inside. And you had to hit the button and then look through the maze again to find the exit. Uh, that's a good idea. That would be a bitch. Um, oh, there it is. Lag, and the maze disappears, except for some of this mess over here. It's just the usual pistons and redstone is glitchy shit. Uh, there's a ladder. I wonder... I actually got most of the redstone back in here. Somewhere. I think it's underneath this block. I can get, get down in here somehow. Come on. There it is. And a ladder. A whole bunch of uh, ridiculous quantity of redstone torches. Yeah. I spawned all this shit in. I, I, when I play around like this, I... I, you know, building something like that, I usually spawn it in. I uh, had my own server on my own computer. And, um, you know, you just use the commands to, you know, spawn everything in. And then, I'm showing this off in single player, so recently I took the, the whole map and just threw it in the single player uh, folder. So down here is a cobblestone generator. Um, there, here's water on one side, lava on the other. This is two blocks deep, uh, just so it never gets hit by water when the pistons are pushing and and then retract. Um, I don't want to blow this up, so it's peaceful here. And here is a shit ton of redstone that drives all the pistons. Here's the bottom of the piston. So when this goes off, uh, this bit of redstone goes off, it'll turn this on and the piston will push up. Now here's a um, redstone clock, it drives the whole thing. Um, I just hit a lever up there, it'll push this block into place and it'll start the timer. And it times everything. All the pistons are hooked up to it. So there's a standard uh, redstone ladder, basically. And it'll push everything up. That's strange. Floating torch. Um, let's see. I think uh, I'll wait till day, and then uh, I'll let this thing go. Alright, it's daytime, and down to the main event. Uh, I don't remember... Do I have two... No, I took. A, I removed the other lever. I had a spare lever for testing. So I'm going to go ahead and flip this and prepare for a little lag. I hope not. Yeah, little lag, that ain't too bad. So down there, it's uh, pushing the cobblestone up and making new cobble with a generator. And, uh. Ooh, shit lag. I'll go down here. Ah! Holy crap lag. Oh my god. So, it's making floors and shit now. There's that floor down there. Huh. Looks like uh, it's not updating everything. It's probably just lagging out too horribly bad. Like craps and all this other shit. I don't know how the hell I got my first video to actually work right. This is a damn mess. Probably because it was a lower resolution and shit. 
So, uh, pretty well cleared everything in, and it should be nearly done. I'm going to have to turn this thing off soon. Let's see, I'm going to get stuck in here. No, I'm not. I'm good. There, it's everything's done but the tower at the top. It took a long time to, you know, play around with the ideas to get this thing right. This tower here was, you know, one of the weirdest parts. Uh, if I wanted to, I could have capped the tower off as well. Let it do that on its own. I didn't really feel like playing with that. It, it, it was a good proof of concept as it is. So, ooh, ugh, ooh, oof, my bunions. And it's pretty well done. Just, you know, a little bit of the tower left to go. Let's see. I doubt it. I'm killing myself. I can get on ladders too, huh? There we go. Now, hopefully, I didn't destroy my recording with that uh, horrible lag of doom. Yeah, my other video is clearly better at showing this thing off. Um, and I'm glad to say that uh, everything still works right in 1.8.1. I, I made this thing in like uh, 1.7 or something. Maybe I can't remember. I'd have to look at that old video. And uh, I think that's it for uh, this world for now. Another time I'll come back and I'll show off this uh, big ass dungeon I made. It's three floors and you know, full of mazes and, you know, puzzles and shit. It is pretty neat.